this is the box, the box set, glorious box set, um, judging by what people have been doing and showing uh, on other various websites. So let's just very gently open up the package. This was supposed to have come by courier, but actually came via the Royal Mail um, in the regular post. But as you can see, uh, as with most new deliveries that I've had, well packaged, which is just as well considering the contents inside. Uh, hopefully, and there it is. And typically with some promotional material from Mute chucked in there, there's a, a Poly Scattergood postcard. Now, if you want to know about Poly Scattergood, you can of course go to the Mute website or check out Poly Scattergood's uh, MySpace page, which is myspace.com forward slash Poly Scattergood, or you can ask Tara Bush, the lady who instigated this video. Um, and she's a big fan of Poly, and so, hey Tara, this might be winging its way to you. <laughs> uh, what else have we got? Oh, yes, apart from the uh, obligatory invoice that tells me how much my advanced birthday present cost, there is this. Apparently this was exclusive to Mute customers. Not much, but it's a Sounds of the Universe poster. Uh, let's see if I can get that better in shot there. There we go. Which is nice. <laughs> now, if I was, you know, an excited teenager, which I guess I am still inside, that might be going up in a bedroom wall, but now I'm a serious adult collector. And that will probably just sit in the box set. Right, here we go! Look at this baby! So as you can see, very well packaged here from, from Mute Bank, as I've always found them to be. So here's the box. As you can see, it's uh, fairly substantial. It's, what, a good uh, 10 by 10-ish vacuum packed. So, let's just very gently open up uh, the polystyrene shrink wrap. And, uh, I do know of individuals that have ordered two of these, one for using and the other one for storing for collectivity. Um, so, you know, you might think I'm a little bit obsessive, but there are many, many others. So, let's have a quick look at the front. Um, as you can see, it's a nice card sleeve that uh, shows you the contents and obviously gives you uh, ratings for the videos. On the rear, nice description of what's actually in the box. There are four discs in here, three CDs, one DVD, two hardback books, a um, couple of enamel badges, there's a poster in there as well, some art cards and a sealed collector's envelope. Um, we've got to test it. Let's, uh, let's crack the baby open and see what's in there. So we'll just slide the sleeve off. That's nice at the back there. That's a bit of artwork. <coughs> First impressions. This is very well made. This is, it feels collectible. It's not flimsy. Good solid, as you can see. Nice, real solid construction. Very nice, very pleasurable. And on the top here, we have the Certificate of Authenticity. Um, trying to read this. Uh, this certificate hereby verifies the authenticity of the limited edition Depeche Mode Deluxe box set release of Sounds of the Universe. High quality ink, paper, board and finishing have been used in the manufacture of this box set which is hand finished and foil blocked. At the top there it has a limited edition number and my limited edition number is one, uh, sorry, 14,809 first edition signed by the band. Obviously not their real signatures. Right, so, um, what's next? Nice little ribbon here to help you uh, pull things out. This, I must admit, looks quite lush. Words and images of the universe, Peshmerga and Anton Corbyn. 
nice hardback book and uh, let me get this so you can all see this lots of uh, imagery typical Anton type picks and uh, littered throughout lyrics very nice love that smell Okay, if you're wondering why there's a few stops and starts in here, it's because I'm having to uh, look after small children at the same time. Right, what else have we got? Um, here is a pack of five artwork cards, um, sealed, not quite sure why, not quite sure why they're sealed. Um, there are 14 different artwork cards, there are the 14 of them there, and uh, they're called remix art cards um, Sounds of the Universe symbol remixed by 14 leading artists and designers that contains a set of five randomly selected cards so there's a perforation just at the top there so you can open those up see that's going to prov provide me with a bit of a quandary do I open it up or do I just leave it as is mm. <laughs> sad I don't know right what else have we got here um, here is what looks like a nice panoramic poster which is quite nice, the uh, quality of the paper is very nice and then we have the second of the two books this is Making of the Universe and this is as you can see quite a odd shaped book certainly for, for most books and this has got a lot of candid studio photography from the sessions uh, recording. So this is going to be great for me and my geeky synth head. Uh, there's a lovely picture of a lovely mini mode there. Um, various other bits of equipment that uh, I will sit here and mentally masturbate over. <laughs> Such is my gear porn fetish. As you can see that's uh, very, no oh! <sighs> very nice book. Some lovely bits of gear there. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> and relax. Okay, what's next? Uh, oh, here's some uh, unique things. Now these are completely unique and there's uh, rumours going around that when we go to the concerts uh, uh, that kick off very soon, and I'm going to the O2 in May, that we all wear these to show we are box set owners. So there's a couple of enamel badges, very nicely made. Uh, what do we have down here? Now, let's tip these out. These don't have a ribbon underneath them, I'm afraid. So there's a little recess here with a nice little DM logo in there. And what we have here is a little credits booklet. This is a nice touch. Everybody gets a bit of a thank you. And also this, which uh, I think is what some members of the uh, Depeche Mode website are going on about as being something that they weren't expecting and it's kind of like a very long panoramic image of the studio um, on both sides now again for geek heads like me that's going to be pretty cool going through and identifying and seeing if there's anything that I have in my studio that maybe Martin and uh, Fletch and Dave have in theirs but of course the thing that we're really interested in are these and these are the discs. So you can see bearing the Sounds of the Universe logo in various basic colours. And we have uh, this is the DVD. And then there's the uh, demos disc. There's 14 demo tracks dating back some way, um, including some of the Sounds of the Universe ones. Then we have the um, bonus tracks and remixes. So it's another 11 tracks on there. And then the regular. CD just there and that my friends is is it $59.99 worth every penny if you ask me that is Sounds of the Universe unboxed 
it was a, a voyage of discovery for myself and you I'm sure hope you enjoyed it, hope you don't think too badly of me and my geeky ways there you go, thank you, bye bye